Recently, we have been seeing videos over the internet talking about how scary and dangerous jobs in the North Sea are. Well, the North Sea is indeed famous for being a challenging and dangerous body of water. Have you ever wondered if these jobs are really that scary? What do they include? What are the risks associated with it? In this video, we are going to see just that. For those of you who don't know, the North Sea, bordered by Norway, Denmark, Germany, the Netherlands, Belgium, and the UK is renowned for its maritime significance, abundant oil and gas reserves, and diverse marine life. It's also notorious for treacherous weather conditions, strong currents, and, and a history of shipwrecks, contributing to its dangerous reputation. According to research, approximately tens of thousands to hundreds of thousands of people sail the North Sea every year. Besides this, there are also people associated with the North Sea for its oil rigs, gas industry, and for resources like fishing. Well, there are more than hundreds of jobs surrounding the North Sea. Working in the North Sea can be both challenging and rewarding. On one hand, it offers opportunities for lucrative employment in the oil and gas industry, with competitive salaries and benefits. However, it also presents significant challenges due to the harsh offshore environment, including rough seas, strong winds, and unpredictable weather conditions. Workers on offshore platforms or rigs often endure long shifts, isolation from family and friends, and demanding work schedules. One of the jobs in the North Sea is that of a sailor. Working as a sailor in the North Sea can indeed be beneficial in terms of travel opportunities and skill development, but sailing in such harsh and dangerous conditions make it hard. Sailors have to be physically fit to bypass these challenges, as well as be strong emotionally due to being far from their families. The storms one can face in the North Sea can lead to hazardous situations such as capsizing, structural damage to vessels, and difficulty in navigation, jeopardizing the safety of both crew and ship. The relentless force of these storms demands exceptional seamanship, resilience, and preparedness from sailors, who must contend with the constant threat of injury, vessel instability, and the potential for being stranded in remote or perilous locations until the storm subsides. On the other hand, there are jobs on oil rigs. In the North Sea, there are about 184 offshore oil rigs, each having around 200 people living and working on board. According to research, some of these oil rigs are often hit by storms in the autumn and winter seasons. Due to these reasons, people working in the oil rigs require specialized training and stringent safety protocols to ensure the overall well-being. Workers on offshore oil rigs in the North Sea face significant risks due to the region's dangerous storms and unpredictable weather patterns. The potential risks include structural damage to the rig from strong winds and waves, which can jeopardize the safety of workers and lead to accidents or injuries. Additionally, the rough seas and challenging weather conditions can make helicopter or boat transportation to and from the rig hazardous, increasing the risk of accidents or incidents during crew changes or emergency evacuations. Moving on, there are also jobs related to commercial fishing and non-commercial fishing in the North Sea. The average annual fish catch in the North Sea is estimated to be around 5 million tons. You might be wondering that fishing ships often decide not to fish when the weather is too harsh. Commercial fishing boats often face the challenge of deciding whether to fish in harsh weather conditions in the North Sea. While some fishing vessels may choose to venture out during inclement weather to meet fishing quotas or take advantage of favorable fishing grounds, many captains prioritize safety and opt to stay in port during severe storms or dangerous conditions. The ones which decide to fish in harsh weather may be due to economic pressures, fishing quotas, as mentioned above, or for the need to meet market demands. There are increased risks to the safety and well-being of crew members, including the potential for accidents, injuries, and even loss of life due to adverse weather conditions. Working in rough seas, high winds, and low visibility can also lead to heightened stress, anxiety, and fatigue among crew members, impacting their ability to perform their duties effectively. Moreover, Prolonged exposure to harsh weather can contribute to physical discomfort, seasickness, and exhaustion, further compromising crew morale and performance. In conclusion, 
Working in the North Sea presents one of the most daunting and perilous challenges for sailors, as well as people working on offshore oil rigs, earning them a reputation as one of the scariest jobs in the world. The relentless storms, freezing temperatures, navigational hazards, and isolation combine to create an environment where bravery, skill, and resilience are paramount. After seeing this, you might be thinking that the North Sea isn't a place for beginners. That's absolutely right. Jobs like the one in the North Sea are in fact scary and tough. To be honest, working in any sea requires a lot of courage and physical well-being as the challenges are tremendous. We should be thankful to the people who are working in these sectors to provide resources that we use in our daily lives. If you are someone who works in the North Sea, share your experience with us in the comments down below. Also, if you don't work in the North Sea, feel free to drop your thoughts down below. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel, as more amazing content is on its way. Thanks for watching.